fans, welcome back to Fuzzy TV, the home of transfers and Bundesliga highlights that I'll bring you every week till the end of the season for Bundesliga. Alright, so let's start with the first awesome transfer news that Inter Milan has officially signed Tider, the Bolognese midfielder for 6.5 million euros. This guy is an amazing player, still 21, still got a lot of talent in him, and he will be a great add on to Inter to play with Guarin. This would be a better team with him. Alright, so Tottenham has officially made it clear that Vivian undergoes the medical already today. So the guys pretty much sealed the deal with Tottenham. They officially stole the player from Liverpool. And now they're going after Eric Lamella. The deal might be actually going through this week. I'm super happy for it because I love this guy. And if he comes in, he could play in Bale's spot. So Bale, you will be on your way to Real Madrid wearing that number 11 shirt where you're supposed to be. Alright, so let's go to Norway where they officially signed ex Bolton striker El Mander. This guy is an amazing Swedish striker, has been playing for Galatasaray lately, has been doing a lot of good. And now he's back to Premier League to help Norwich to stay out of relegation zone. Will he be a great add-on? Will he help him stay out of relegation zone? I don't know. Anyway, so Robert Lewandowski is no more unsettled. Uh, Borussia Dortmund has officially paid him 4 million euros more this season so the guy is staying for the rest of the season and if they do good he will be staying for longer than we actually think please god all right so tottenham is officially agreed to a 94 million euro bid for gareth bale from real madrid this guy is gonna fly in this week talk about his contract with real madrid you know what the guy the guy had it coming he's an amazing talent but you know what him leaving Tottenham is actually a great help because Tottenham now has so much money they just bought pretty much a whole new team and this guy made it all happen. So Gareth Bale, thank you so much. Hope you have a great career at Real Madrid and see you later maybe down the road you might come back to Tottenham one day. Alright, so Chelsea holds talk with Samuel Eto'o in London today. They're already trying to agree the deal, the deal with Samuel Eto'o to see if the guy will come and help out Chelsea fight for that Premier League spot, win championship this year. I don't know, tell me if Ch uh, Chelsea FC will win the treble this year, will Mourinho be the chosen one this year? Alright, so Tottenham are ready to discuss a 20 million euro bid for Real Madrid uh, left back. Fabio Cointreau, this guy is an amazing player, but he seems to be coming real close to Tottenham and Tottenham is just building an amazing team like I said already. I'm happy for Tottenham, I'm happy for Andre Villas boys. everybody dissed on him before, not me because I love that guy, he did amazing things at Porto, he did amazing things at Chelsea, brought that Mata in, and now he's doing amazing things at Tottenham. So Tottenham, keep it going, keep on signing players. So Roma wanting to sign Dan Baba. This guy is an amazing striker, still got a little bit of talent in him, he just slowed down at Chelsea because he's not the number one man. Since Pablo Oswaldo has went to Southampton, Den Baba will be a great add-on to Roma. Especially in Italy, you do great, man. Alright, so again, again and again, Tottenham take lead in Toby, uh, Toby Alderweire from Ajax. This guy is an amazing defender, Tottenham needs him. Tottenham are ready to sign this guy. So Spartak Moscow has already pulled out out of the lead. So now Tottenham is in the lead of signing this player and that will be awesome. Another signing that Tottenham might be making is Vlad Kritches. So they revived the bid. This guy is an amazing defender. Still got lots of years in him. Again, Tottenham is not only building midfield. They're actually going after defense. So I actually think Tottenham will be contenders for that Premier League this year. They won't be fighting for that fourth spot. They'll be fighting for that first spot with Manchester United and Chelsea. Alright, so this is a huge blow for Arsenal. Arsenal and Arsene Wenger. So PSG are ready to put in 20 million years for Kabai. Jesus, Arsenal, come on, Arsene Wenger, you have money, you've been saving money, you are ready to spend money, come on you freaking Frenchman, I thought it was only Jews and German people that didn't want to spend money, come on, 
build a great team with Arsenal, win the Premier League, win the Championship League like I always wanted, and show your fans that you're the right coach for all those years. Alright fans, hope you guys enjoy my soccer news. Subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe to Team Soccer TV. Pretty soon there will be an awesome website for you guys to go and watch highlights of every league, and news and standings and everything you need, all the rumors, all the transfers. So I hope to see you later and enjoy my videos.